All right, we're going to do some examples of problems using the centroid, which is the point um, where it's the point of concurrency of the medians of a triangle. And uh, we know some relationships with these medians that um, the distance from the midpoint of one side to the centroid is one third of the total distance. And um, it's also one half the distance from the, um, from the centroid to the vertex. So we're going to use those relationships that we know um, to find the, the lengths of these uh, segments that we've been asked to find. So first we're told that YW equals 2. And so um, that's, uh, let's see, YW right here, 2. Okay. We want to find TY, right? and also the, the whole median from T to W. So um, as we just said, we know that the distance from the median to the centroid is half the distance from the centroid to the vertex. So that means that YW, which is that you know, uh, median to the, the midpoint to the centroid, it's one half of TY. So we know YW is 5, so 5 equals 1 half, uh, sorry, not 5, 2, it's 2. Uh, let's see, 2, uh, YW is 2, and that's 1 half of TY. So we multiply both sides by 2, and we get uh, TY equals 4, okay? Um, and then we want to find um, TW. Well, there's a couple ways to do that. You can either take, uh, you know, we know that YW is one-third of the whole thing, or we can just take the two and the four and add them together, and either way we get TW equals six, okay? So there's uh, answers to that first line there, okay? And then YU is 24, so um, that's right here, 24. Obviously, these two problems are not... Um, in the same scale, so that's okay. Um, we'll just take them independently. YU is 24. We want to find ZY and ZU. So YU is the distance from the vertex to the centroid. To find YZ, which is the distance from the centroid to the midpoint, right? we know that one is, is half the other. We know that YZ, the distance from the centroid to the midpoint, is one half uh, YU, the distance from the uh, uh, centroid to the vertex. And we know that one, right? It's 24. And so half of 24 is 12, right? So YZ is 12. Okay? And then again, we have uh, the two parts, so we can add them together to get the whole. So UZ or ZU, either way, is uh, 36, right? Okay, I'm going to move those over a little bit. Uh, maybe I won't. Never mind. Uh, I'll just use the room I have over here. So VX is 33. And this time we have, we're given the whole uh, median. The whole median is 33. And v, we want to find VY and VX. So VY, we'll just take the first one, take them as they come. VY is the distance from the uh, vertex to the centroid, which is two-thirds of the whole thing. So we know VY equals two-thirds of uh, XV, or VX. Okay, well, we know what VX is. It's 33. Okay, and 33, we can divide by 3 is 11. And multiply by 2, that's 22. So VY is 22. Um, and then again, we have the whole thing is 33. The... Um, this one part that we found is 22, so we can subtract those to get x, y, which is, of course, 11. So there's those two answers. So uh, there you go.